My boss is always giving me these motivational sales books. They bought the farm, now sell them the cows. Stuff like that. Better take these cards. It looks like a long day of solitaire for me. It's my boss's secretary, Ava. It's my boss's whipping boy, Manny. Buenos dias. Manny, why aren't you at the poisoning? Any messages for me? Besides the one about the poisoning? Yeah. I only have one other message for you, Manny. I'm not your secretary. I don't take your messages. So get it through your thick skull and stop forwarding your phone to me. All right. But that sounded more like four messages to me. Busy as ever, I see. I'd have more work to do if you had more clients. Ouch. Where is everybody? Oh, Manny, did you forget what day it is today? Oh, man, did I come in on Saturday again? It's the Day of the Dead. Everybody's back in the land of the living, visiting their families like we should be. What poisoning? The Code 3 gazpacho poisoning that everybody's at but you. Why do I send out memos if nobody reads them? Well... I gotta go hit the bricks. Okay, you show those bricks a lesson. Big Mr. Boss Man doesn't want to be disturbed today. Lights for wash, rinse, wax, and land of the living, depending on your destination. Here's what I need. Wheels. I might get hurt if I try to get one down by myself. Not picking that up. It's locked. Hey, who the, who's messing with my stuff? Oh, it's... Sorry, sir. I didn't expect the sales agents usually don't come over to this part of the garage. Hey, you a driver? Me? Ha! No. No, no, no. I don't ride them. Just wrench them. Nice hut. Yeah. I wonder how nice it would seem to you if you were trapped in it all day like me. I'm Calavera. Manny Calavera. My name's Gladys. I don't get many visitors. Hey! I got a message for a Mr. Calavera. Uh, your driver said that Mr. Hurley said that he could have the rest of the day off. Domino sent my driver home? Yeah, wasn't that nice? Looks like I need a new driver. Oh! I, uh, I, uh, I would agree with that. Yes? You do. You want to be my replacement driver? Me? Oh, oh, no. Sorry. Can't. Rules.
Come on, Gladys. I need you to be my driver. No, I can't. I'm... I'm... I'm too big. You're not too big. You're just right. No, they told me again and again. I'm too big to drive. You're not too big. You just have a self-image problem. A what? Repeat after me. I am not fat. I am thin. Women find me attractive. Hey, I never said I was too fat for the ladies. Just the cars. The ladies like me just fine. <laughs> <laughs> Screw the rules. Come with me. No, I don't want to get in trouble again. They said one more strike and I'm out. Well, do you know anyone who can drive? Everybody's gone. It's the day of the dead, you know. Yeah, yeah, I know. Okay, see you later, chicken. Yeah. Okay. There's something big going on in there. Not picking that up. It's locked. Hey, who the... Huh? Gladys? Gladys? Is that a German name? Oh no! My... I am an... Or to check... If you hate your job, why don't you quit? It's not just a job. It's what I was created to do. If I get any farther away from cars than this, I'll get sick and die. It's like I'm not happy unless I'm breathing in the thick, black, nauseating fumes. <sighs> hmm, can't imagine. All right, back in the shack, Mac. Later, Oni. Oni. Genie, come out of the lantern already. Huh? Come on, Gladys. I need you to be my driver. I told you. I'm too big. You're not too big. The cars are just too small. Yeah, those dang compact cars. Hey, that gives me an idea. I could alter your car just a bit with just a quick torch job to let out the seams, you know? Uh, I'm not allowed to modify the cars without a work order from upstairs. I could lose my job. A work order, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't torch anything bigger than a cigarette without one of these signed by the boss himself. Hey, hey, hey. that's my line. Getting people to sign back in a snap. Yeah, too small. I'm not too big. Everything around here is just too small. I've got to get this work order signed. Who's afraid of a little rusty water? Not picking that up. Ooh, I might get hurt if I try to get one down by myself. Ooh, I might get hurt if I try to get one down by myself. The driver demons operate this somehow, and the company won't tell a salesman how it works. It's some sort of special work order. I've got to get this work order signed. Not 
picking that up. Can't go through on foot. People have tried, but they never came back. It's locked. I left my tow truck back in my other suit. We can't operate cars. That's how they keep us from skipping town. Going down, clown. Hey, back off, suit. I'm practicing. Practicing what? Wringing your neck. What does it look like? Twist me up one of them, huh, fella? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Twist this, all right? Bet you can't do a cat. Shows what you know, buddy. I can do anything. I can do birds, amphibians, famous poets. Go ahead. Name one. Okay, a cat. No problem. Ta-da! Can I walk through your tent? I'm gonna see the parade. Well, walk through someone else's tent, all right? Do I look like a turnstile to you? Some festival, huh? Yeah, yeah, pretty busy. My carpal tunnel syndrome's really acting up. But you don't have any tendons. Yeah, well, you don't have a tongue. But that doesn't seem to shut you up, now does it? Bang! Popped another one. Lousy, bony fingers. My kid uh, wants another balloon animal. Ah, oh, jeez. What now? A dingo? That's my specialty. Ta-da! Looks like some sort of crafty mine. It looks like a rope, but it's really just a bunch of cheap ties tied together. It looks like Don's rigged his computer to automatically answer his intercom. Not picking that up. I'll just change his auto response here. I'm on the phone! This place is a mess. I would love to search Don's office right now, but I'm late for the poisoning. No time to ransack. Everybody's at the poisoning but me. To 
all employees of the Department of Death Bureau of Acquisitions, employees who have made their sales quarters are invited to take the Day of the Dead as a holiday, as long as they make up the time lost on the following weekend. Idiota. I'll come back after the poisoning and search the whole room. More junk I don't have time to look through. I'll come back after the poisoning and search the whole room. I'll come back after the poisoning and search the whole room. It's a squeaky little kitty. It's just a regular old balloon dog. I don't see what's so... My scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. I don't want to mess up my blade. Way before my time, I heard he was a total slave driver. Mind if I use your hole punch? Knock yourself out. Gets the aggressions out, doesn't it? Eva, I really need the boss to sign this work order. I'll give it a shot. Mr. Copel, I've got Manny Calavera out here to see you. I'm on the phone! Eh, sorry, Cal. Maybe tomorrow. That's too late. Oh yeah, like you're going anywhere.
I really need the boss to sign this work order. I'll give it a shot. Mr. Copel, Mr. Calavera has something out here that he says he needs your signature on. Ah, oh, cripe, Saber! Just sign it yourself, will you? I'm busy! You'll have to excuse him, Manny. It's probably a really hard crosswood puzzle he's got in there today. Eva, I'm impressed. I had no idea you had this kind of power. Well, we all have our secrets. They say black is slimming. I'm driving, yeah! I'm driving! <laughs> Por favor. I could have walked faster than this. Ah, uh, híjole, I'm gonna miss the poisoning. Travel package upgrades if you care to cut the yap. I want something cheap where I can get some rest, and that's it. Ay, ay, ay. You know, Manny, I could make this car a little faster if you wanted. Yeah, yeah. 
Whatever. Oh, yeah, slam the front into the weeds, tub the rear end, do blowers, pop it out of the hood. You'll get plenty of rest this way, Mr. Martinez, and you'll be safely padded by the foam created when these two chemicals mix like this. Oh, on second thought, I want to upgrade my package. Sorry, Bruno, but you didn't qualify for anything better. But here, have this complimentary mug. No, wait! Uh, can't you find me something where I can move my legs? You know I'd like to, Bruno, but my boss is a real hard ass. I gotta be a hard ass when I got lazy sickle waivers like this jolly boy working for me. Manny, you couldn't find a sale at a yacht club. I got a sale right here. I'm talking premium sales, Calavera. Like the kind Domino makes. How am I supposed to make premium sales with the scumbag clients you're sending me? Hey! Now you're blaming the clients? I've had it with you, Manny. If you haven't bagged a premium before the next sales report comes in, you're out! Out on the street, no job, no way to work off your time. Just your fancy suit and your big smile and a whole lot of time to kill. Who you calling a scumbag? Why, well, I ought to... <sighs> I'm sick of waiting around for a good lead. Like it's gonna fly in here tied to a brick. It's time to take one.